welcome to NSNP TV. Thanks for tuning in to the channel, otherwise known as No Sight, No Problem. Remember, the only handicap you have is when you decide to say you can't. Anyways, today I'm going to show you how to change an axle and hubs on a tandem axle utility trailer and change the tongue jack. Somebody was towing it and didn't have the bearings greased properly and lost a hub and tire were going down the road and ruined the axle in the process. So now we're going to show you guys how to fix it. So let's get right in it. I already have it jacked up and kind of ready to go. And of course it's hot as balls here. But that's to, to be expected. But hey, we are supposed to get some rain. Which should be appreciated. Yep, so you can take a break and not do it because nobody in Florida works in the rain. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I'll have to tell that story someday because that was pretty that was pretty crazy, wasn't it? It was. Uh, I love when I Oh I found it. Hey hey. In the grass and all. Lucky day. Alright, so tire is off. Alright. And uh got a u-bolt here and a u-bolt there and the nuts are down in the bottom and I start breaking them free if you want to take them to the other side and show them the damage that's been done and this is the one that was already tire off fell off in transport all right so we got them broke loose with the big ratchet now we got the half inch drive dewalt impact gun out get the rest of the u bolt nuts off all right she's all unbolted Let's slide this bad boy out of here. Come on, let's see what we got. Alright, that's just like barbells. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. There you go. Okay. Alright. That's it. Alright. Okay, I'm done being silly now. <laughs> Okay, as you can see, the new axle is in place. It's sitting um, on top of the springs. Everything is lined up. So now we're gonna put the U-bolts in. Make sure this plate goes on the bottom and I will show you how that goes in. And just like the golf carts I was showing you, you got four holes, one there, 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 there. Those are for your U-bolts. This one in the center, is for the alignment pin on your spring. So everything really only should go together one way. So it'll go on the bottom. And it'll line up just like so. Then a the U-bolt comes over the top of the spring. And in a perfect world, we'll go through a plate just like that. That's perfect. Now I gotta play monkey man. Get a washer and a bolt here. Hold everything in place while I get some more hardware together. Okay, there. It's not perfect, but it'll hold it for just. Get back in place. Stop being difficult. All right, there. That's all back in place the way it should be. Put this washer there. This nut right here. Oh that one's in place. I'm gonna fix this nut here. Oops, just a little better. Lord have mercy. Okay, now look at 
Get the inside bolt. Again, over the spring and into the plate. Everything should just go together nice and easy. You shouldn't have to fight anything. If you start fighting things, then make sure everything's lined up because if you're fighting it, then you've got a problem. There we go, just like so. Set the washer in place. Grab the nut. And these, this particular pack, these are lock nuts, so they only gonna go on one way. The cone part will face the ground. There we go. Get my other washer and nut. All right, my friends, and that is one side of the axle in place. Obviously I need to tighten it up, but that is how you, that is how you do it. Here's that bolt there. And we'll put this, there we go, that's lined up. One. Okay, that too, thank you. Yep. All right. Okay, I need another washer and a nut, please. Thank you. You're welcome. You're a lovely assistant. I want that other bolt. <laughs> you don't mind? Why, thank you. You're welcome. Turn your hand over. All right. Fourth of July weekend upon us. Don't know exactly what we're doing yet, but we will definitely be doing something. Okay, I need that uh, socket up there, ratchet please. I don't remember what size socket's on there. This is a three quarter socket. Three quarter inch socket. All right. So now we need, to, so remember when you tighten up U-bolts, you always want to go in a cross pattern. This lane here is the old axle. Now you saw it installed underneath, but it's just laying there, out of place, no home anymore. Wait, are you saying that axle's homeless? It's a homeless axle. Oh shit. You're gonna offend somebody. Okay, right. so the other side's all done. We'll just finish tightening this side up. Oops. And all we got to do is put some tires on her. All right, I believe that'll do it. Okay. I guess I had to get some tires and a jack. And we will be back. Guess I need... All right, last time. It's almost time for some water. What do you think, honey? Uh -huh. As in, like, ocean water? <laughs> right. All right. And that is how you change the axle, axle and hub assembly on a trailer. Come 